Yes guys, in this video we're going to show you how to cheat the knuckleball. That's right, this experiment shows you that the different air pressures of the ball affect how much knuckle and how much movement you can get on the ball. We've got three balls here, that one's rock hard, that one's normal and this one is super soft. What's the difference? Yes guys, we're going to start off with the rock hard football. Um, this one's going to be tough. You ready Jess? Yeah. Here's rock hard. Knuckle, is a bit of knuckle there. I must admit, it's hard with this hard football, it's proper tough. But um, I'm looking forward to the softer ball and then the really soft ball. I think that's where you're gonna get the, the movement that you need for a knuckle ball. Any, any ballers out there who are questioning themselves if your foot stings when you strike a, a rock, a, a ball that's pumped up too much in the cold, it happens to the very, very, very best of us. <laughs> Ask him, guilty. <laughs> Guilty! <laughs> oh, it's knuckle again. It's knuckle. Mate, it's knuckle when I am freezing. Again. I didn't strike that as well as I could have. Didn't see any spin. But with the hard ball, you don't really see didn't see too much movement there, even though there wasn't there wasn't really much spin on that. Definitely we're expecting more movement the more we reduce the PSI. This one's the, at the moment it's rock hard. We're making this the mediocre, that's no more than that. And that is how you score. Sorry, I can't even talk about it. It's so swazzy, I cannot even talk. So, um, right now I'm going to go for a little knuckleball, Jed. Little knuckleball now. Oh, that'll go for the easy one. Excuse me. Still, um, why is Bill saving in here? Oh. Right. Strikes are there though. The strikes are there. So we've already done a tutorial on the knuckleball. I think Jez, you smashed that one out. But just a few points from us on how you can master it. My first point would be um, toes pointing down when striking the ball and aiming for this part of the foot. Jez, what's next? What would you say? Toes pointing down, strike through the heart of the ball. Yeah, through the middle of the ball. No follow through. No follow through. Your target is no spin. So you don't want backspin. You can have top spin, to be fair, top spin or no spin qualifies as a knuckleball. That's how you get that obscure movement. Well, he's left me no room for improvement there, has he? He's absolutely smashed it. You can, the only way you can elaborate on this nonchalant breakdown. Just doing it. Is just doing it. Just doing it. Right. I'm gonna do it. You ready? There was one other thing. I don't know why, but the best, best knuckleball guys kind of hit it with that part of the foot and they kind of hit it and go through. Re a really strange technique. Ready? 
Oh. See what I mean? I mean, don't get me wrong, the direction was terrible, but it's just about showing you the technique today. How what? many knuckleball goals have you seen that go in bang centre in the middle of the goal? Because the keeper, he's, he's chucked to left or right. Yeah, but, but there ain't no sat nav, yeah. it's just a bit of movement. That ain't this, this might, but that ain't fooling nobody, mate. This might fool nobody. I'll take the goal in a match, not a knuckleball, but I'll take the goal. Alright then guys, we're onto the softball now, as you can see. Softer than the others. This ball should get some good movement. Now, I'm no knuckleball expert, but if you hit it right, it should, the lighter ball should really move. Oh my god, yes. Did you see that movement? It's so much easier. You can hit the ball softer and still get maximum movement with that ball. I mean, that felt pretty good. Let me have another go. That felt pretty good. So much easier with a softer ball. Look, oh, I mean, it wasn't a very good shot, but you can see the technique of the ball moving all over the place. This is like effortless to get that technique. The movement's unreal, just slightly softer. I mean, this isn't a flat football. This is just a soft football. If you have a look, I'm pushing this in as hard as I can. It's not extremely flat, just soft. I had a dream about Cristiano Ronaldo last night, an actual dream. What happened? Oh. I hope he was collabing with us. No, he... He come to live in my caravan. Yeah, he's got a caravan. No, 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 no. We've done a book tour together and we're in a camper van. Oh! And like, I, it literally got to the point where people were asking for an autograph and I'm saying, I've got to get you out of here, mate. And like, I was saying to people, no, 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 he's got to go, he's got to catch a flight. And literally, we were like that. It was so weird. Like, <laughs> touring around the country with a book on a book tour, sort of signing tour. Mate. Could happen. Wait. Me, you and Cristiano, or just you and Cristiano? It was just me and Cristiano. Oh, I've been outed! <laughs> I've been outed! It I'd... was literally just me and Cristiano. <laughs> but do you know what? I'll take it from him. He can out me. F2, Billy and Cristiano. Even that, that wasn't, I didn't strike that as sweet as I could, but with the softball, it almost guaranteed that movement. You can, it, it, what, what I'm trying to say is, the softball definitely allows for discrepancies in the quality of your techers. And I know for a fact, there's several YouTubers out there who only do knuckleballs with softballs. I want you, I'm not gonna expose you. I'm not gonna expose you. I just know that I'm onto you. What's going on? Just picturing what the world would be like if my head was upside down. Would, if my head was upside down, would my brain tell me that it is? And then work the other? In fact, that's what happens anyway, isn't it? Don't, like, we, everything is upside down, but the brain tells you it's not. Yeah, I think so. See? Now, brain, what you're doing now, you're seeing it as if it's upside down, but really it's not upside down because you changed it around in the first time! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's it. That's the movement we're looking for. Again, the softball, it just, it can go anywhere. No, I know these you haven't got to put so much power on it and you still get the movement. Yeah. So we do and this ball isn't even like, this ball isn't super soft, this is just a soft ball. I think if we let the ball down even more, you can get even more movement. So, if you want to learn a knuckle ball, I would suggest practicing with a soft ball, and then once you learn it, improve, put more air in it, so you're improving as you go and it's easier. 100%, 100%. Definitely moves a lot more with the softball, 100%. Again, this is just a quick experiment, so we're not aiming for top bins. We're just testing. It's more about the pressure of the ball and getting to the bottom of the facts. And the fact is, 
The softer the ball is, the more it moves. Dave, is it going to be rude if I sign out on this shot? I mean, can you end on this shot? Well, I won't take offence to it. You might I can't do. Speak for the top pins. What about the edit guys when they see it? Where are they going to go after this? Mate, they're used to it. You think? Yeah. yeah. They're used to it. <laughs> well, they used to it, they got to get used to it, Jess. I'll tell you what, put it there, brother, and I will see you tomorrow. <laughs>